Yo, what's up, guys? And welcome back. And today, myself and my friends, we kind of did something for you guys. Um, we want to show you guys um, where to get some of the rare treasure cards that people use in PV PvP. And you're kind of wondering, well, how do they get so many of those? Where do they get them? Well, we're going to show you how to get them or explain to you how to get the treasure cards. And my friends have actually took the time out to look up the treasure cards, go to the locations. And so we're gonna do that right now. And um, each of them have like a different card. I'm gonna show you guys a picture of it so you understand what it is and you can look at it and explain that way, but also they're gonna tell you about it. So right now, my friend Anthony is explaining to you about Feeble and where we're standing. And I'm gonna show you the map while he talks so that you guys can see all that but go ahead and and all right well um and feebles two pips it's no auction you can't buy it in bazaar and you can't sell it but it drops by this storm boss i don't know if i can hit tumulus tumulus something like that with a tumulus the good thing is um if you have a higher level friend you can pour it in on like a magus or a grandmaster or something and he'll drop in feeble and you can destroy those freaking Isis who just played stack. Yes. And you don't even have to have a pet, so and people OP. Okay, so right here where we're at, this is to where Tomulus is located at, and um, like he said, Invivable removes all blades. All the blades, so it's a two-pip spell that removes all blades. It's a storm spell, but any school can use it, and it's really good for that. Um, so this is Tomulus and Palace of Fang's Chamber in the Hive. All right, guys, we'll be right back with the next TC. <laughs> okay, while well, they're, like, playing around, <laughs> I don't know what they're doing, but anyway, <laughs> this next card is one of my favorites, and it's actually really hard to get. I've, o I've only maybe had in my, maybe five of them, and it's called Shift. <laughs> so, Val's going to explain to you what Shift is, and then tell... Um, you where to get it, which is right behind Holy us. So I'm gonna show them it. Okay, <laughs> so these guys right here, they're called Tundra Trolls. They drop the shift treasure card, which is extremely useful in PvP. Um, I've had a couple battles where I've used uh, stack, a sacked King Artorius, and an Ice Wizard just used that TC and shifted it right back to my face and won the match. So you can use it for that uh, against Smith. You can use it against Fires when they're using Firezilla. It's just it's an amazing treasure. Not card. Firezilla. What's the you burning. mean burning rampage? Yes. Like that, whatever it's called. We've <laughs> we've all done PvP and they've used burning rampage. The thing about shift is when they use it, when you use shift, you put all that damage when it's done on them. So you shift that little over time onto them so they get the so if you're first you can shift it right back on them and is, that next turn they're going to get all the damage possibly killing themselves which is just amazing so it doesn't just get rid of the overtime it gives your opponent all the damage of the overtime so it's pretty amazing to have in pvp if you have that in your deck um, it's useful for ice everything any overtime is put on their little it's better than um Triage actually. Triage just gets rid of it. This gives puts it on your opponent. So well, hello. Triage is zero pips. So well, there's, there's a trade for it. I kind of like shifting. Triage is more efficient if it's like a weaker overtime. But if you're reversing someone with a really strong overtime, like uh, Brennan Graham for King Artorias, the then shifts, but, yeah. yeah. All right, guys, we're off to the next TC. Hold on, I got another okay, sweepers. Okay. Okay. So right now we're fixing to tell you guys about triage and mass triage. Well, I'm not going to tell you, but Hunter's going to tell you. So take it away, Mr. Muhammad. All right. So first, do you hate that pesky overtime from Rampage? Oh well, here you go. You use triage. You take it off. You destroy the fire wizard. Easy done. You fight this boss named Sweepers in this exact cave. And you're done. Farm them all day, get triage for days, you wreck fires. There or you go. Or any other school that uses overtimes. So right here, I'm showing you guys and the map in Vesterland. This is where you get triage. It removes overtime damage spells, any of them. So it takes zero pips, and it just removes the overtime. So it's very useful in all PvP. All PvP. It's a great spell. I don't do PvP without it in any of my decks, even on my Storm. So, this is where you get it in Vesterlin, and where my little guy is spinning right there. You guys are seeing me spin. So, okay, 
uh, Hunter's also going to tell us where to get mass triage. So we're going to go there right now and we'll be right back. Well, we don't have to be right back. Just port there. Uh, Brandon's got it marked, don't you, Brandon? Uh, Brandon. <laughs> okay, well, Here, I'll let's run go to find it. it. He, he, he's going to run to it. We'll just keep Famous recording while he runs to it. You were supposed to have it marked, Brandon. <laughs> it was no. Mass Triage. It's by Brandon, Ice Brandon Bright Elf in Polaris, Rizzer of, uh, River <laughs> no, of... Basically, basically what? all you need to know is that if you use Mass Triage in 2v2, then you're a god. Yeah. Oh, gee. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh, they just cut the video. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Just go there. Yeah, I'm heading to it right now. <laughs> Just go there. Just. Oh, who got pulled in? I'm gonna laugh. Ha! <laughs> it's Evan. <laughs> I'm gonna fight. I'm gonna do it. I can do it. That's what hubba, you get. That fishing gear. Hubba, hubba. He's gonna spam that queen calypso. Mm. Hunter, tell me when you're there. Did you even add me? Oh no. Oh, oh boy, I have to wait for Val. Val, did you add him? No, I did yeah. the. You, okay. It's in your. Should be in your chat. Heather is. You, I punch see that. You. I said that. <laughs> just add my fire under my desk, or you can just go tell it to Val. There, I just added you. Cool tell me when you're there, because we right, got you, I'm Adam. There. All right, guys, we're going to Mr. Hunter, and he's fixing to tell you all about the mass triage. Go for it. All right. So you have multiple fires, or you're just going two v two. You can mass triage, babe. <laughs> Fighting these ice blight elves for you know mass triage, so you're not you don't have to just be a life wizard to cast that shit. So there you go. <laughs> there you go, guys. It's right here in the river of frozen tears, in player. You come from four long tag, and right here where you see the river, there you go. These ice guys here. So it's pretty easy when there's mobs. It's always a lot better to farm mobs than an actual boss. So mass triage is here, and we're gonna be right back because Brandon's gonna tell us where to get ash and bones and then we, we're gonna start with that by doing like ash and bones we're gonna get the fire shark ice shark even juju so we'll be right back okay guys so right now we're at the place okay so we have the tc's fire shark and ice shark which are two pips each a very very overpowering spell and it's extremely useful in low level and, and high level as well but most people use it in lower level pvp both of the TCs come from two different plants, one being fish on the vine and purple snow apples. So right here is where you can um, farm for the fish on the vine that you can get both the fire shark and ice shark from. And it's pretty easy. You just come right here. It's in Celestia. If you look, you can come from the Celestia ba base camp into Crustacean Empire and all the way up here at the top where the barbarican is but that's not what this place is called let me show you here so that you can see better oh it doesn't show me oh great well anyway guys <laughs> that's where it's at and um that is for the the um, plant fish on a vine and we'll be right back to tell you guys some more all right so right now we're standing in front of the place where you're gonna farm for arctic zilla not the Arctic Zilla treasure card, but the Ultra Dandelions that drop the Ultra that drop the Arctic Zilla treasure cards. So if you fight any of the Imperial Guards in Polaris, they drop Ultra Dandelion, which Ultra Dandelion gives you Arctic Zilla, which is an OP ice four pip spell. You all have seen it and always want it, but you go to the bazaar and it's just not there. If you're looking to do low level ice PvP and you want that card, you can come to Polaris. I'll show you on the map here. You can come here and this is where you're going to go to farm it. Really easy. It's right in Walrusburg. You can see where I'm like, my, my little arrow is spinning right there. You can go inside here and continue to farm. And then when you plant this, when you plant the Ultra Dandelions, also since they're Ultra, you can get them in any of the one shot dungeons in the crown shop. So if anybody's going, go with them. Um, the ultra plants drop some pretty good stuff. Um, so right in here, you can get the Arctic Zilla. So we'll be right back with the next one. Okay, guys. Now Hunter's going to tell you guys about the fire spell, Ash and Bones. Hit it, Hunter. All right. So if you're a fire wizard and you always want to scale the dragon, you can always get Ash and Bones from these guys named Inspector Brigaders. And basically, that's it. You just farm them and have a chance of getting Ash and Bones. Yep. They're right here in Walrusburg. Harbor, you can see where I'm spinning right there. 
And when we come back, I'm going to tell you about, about the few remaining um, cards and stuff that you can get. Actually, right here, though, it's not for a plant. This is actually the drop of the treasure card. So, yeah, good luck with that one. And we'll be ba right back to tell you about a few extras and tell you guys some interesting things like uh, where to get juju. Bad juju. We know we all want that. Come on. All right. Be right back, guys. Okay, guys. Uh, so for the next treasure card. cards, let's go with bad juju. 101s i know you guys really would like to know where to get it you can get it by planting saw palmettos saw palmettos are farmed from sir blackwater in darkmoor in the first dungeon you know the first part of darkmoor and um i'm sure you guys ran across them through um some of your like like on the game you guys should be really careful like when you open packs and everything to keep your plants that's why they have the seed vaults so um, saw palmettos give you bad juju and I've gotten rid of a lot of them and wish I would have known that Okay, so lore master you get from um, the best way to get lore master You can get it from sword ferns, which is a plant, but the best way to get lore master is to farm actual lore master Or it can be craftable So you can craft it um, That's the best ways to get that um there's a bunch of bosses but they're really hard and and they take up a lot of time so supernova comes from the plant sunions um sunions you can get in the crown shop or you can go do Ra, the secret boss through the crocotopia crocotopia library um let's see what did i forget i think we got everything now yeah that's all on our list so what I want you guys to do is anytime you come up with a treasure card uh, that I've not said in here or any kind of, you know, card that people might need, put it down in the comment section. Write down the card, write down where to get it, you know, give them the area. So um, we can use this as a reference to go back to when we need these things. So you guys fill the comment sections up with other treasure cards and items that people might really want and put it down there so we can get it because like I really want to know where some other stuff is so I hope you guys put it down there so that I can comment and tell you thank you but um this is Heather and everybody out for now I love you guys I'll check y'all out later peace guys say bye see you, bye huh? see you fam bye, bye. goodbye yeah.